and welcome to Disney Meg's Coloring. If you're new here, my name is Megan and I'm so excited to be here with you today. So today is my January plans video, which you will be seeing the very last day of December 31st, New Year's Eve. Yes, um, I'm going to start off with saying sorry to all my buddies out there. Um, I did my best. I still have the rest of today to get some done. I'm going to try really hard. I did not get to finish. This is the first time ever I have not finished all. Well, there was one month I didn't finish one. But it's been a very, very difficult month for me. Um, November and December, any holiday actually is very hard for me. And I uh, actually just didn't want to do anything. Um, and then I got busy and then as you saw in my last video, um, I was watching my brother's dog who would not let me do anything. Uh, he just wanted my undivided attention the entire time. So yeah, um, he left last night. So, um, that's why this is going up. I'm filming it, editing, excuse me, editing it and, uh, getting it up today. So, um, this is my uh, coloring journal. I didn't change it. I'm not going to change it. This goes all the way through July because um, I started it in August. So I'm going to go August through July, kind of like um, a school year one. So I will get a new one come next July. Um, but yeah, um, I didn't change anything in the front. Um, I did add, did I add this? No, I had this one. I made, I had it. So, um, here I have, I added some of these, which you guys saw in a haul. So I have my books to complete eventually, which I do have a completed book. Um, you will see that in my completed pages. So I do need to add a new one. Haven't decided which one. Um, my full book buddy colors, which some of these have changed. I need to fix that. The group buddy color books. My pencil versus paper test that I need to get back to. Um, hashtag stuff. This is my coloring book video collection I finished. So I need to take that out. Uh, my oh hoo hoo inventory. <laughs> you don't need to see that. Um, and here I did, um, this is 2023. And then I made a new one for 2024. So you guys can see, I did this one. So here we have 2024, we are so ready. I did some goals, which um, are personal. So I'm keeping those to myself. I tried to do 24, I only got 13. Um, possible books to complete, I have written down there to add to it. Um, anyway, so here is January, all ready, set, ready to go. Um, I used my washi tape is from Simply Gilded. Uh, this January is Exo Mama Plans along with the um, days of the week. The bows are I couldn't tell you. I it's escaped my brain. If I think of it, I'll let you know. But for some reason, it's escaped my brain. Um, and I don't know the snowflakes, who those are from. These are, I, yeah. And these are the stickers from that set uh, that I showed in one of my hauls. And then um, I'm not doing any buddy colors. So, um, so, you know, I am not doing any buddy colors whatsoever this month. Um, I might do some of the big group. I'm going to do my Ivy and the Inky Butterfly. I will do that one. And then, um, but other than that, I am, I am taking the month off. So that way I don't feel like I'm obligated to anyone and I have to color and I need a month, <laughs> a month to have. If I don't get anything done, I don't get anything done. And that is okay. Um, I need, yeah to take a little time off, especially after Christmas it was crazy. Anyway, 
Here is my completed pages. I have those ready to go. I didn't make as many. Um, my I didn't put body colors in here, so my challenges and prompts are ready to go. I have my um, Facebook. Have I written in it? No. My Facebook fun is what I call this page. Um, I have a Facebook group that I co-host with Amanda from Amanda Colors. If you have not joined us, we would love to have you. We do so many fun things. We've added some things for 2024, which I am totally excited about. We do scavenger hunts. We have title page Tuesdays. We are doing a full book color along um, or buddy color, which those books I will be coloring in also. Um, I have to do Decembers because I didn't do December, so I have to play catch up. And then here we have my uh, end of the month wrap up. So, yeah, I will be doing a video coming up. I want to do my completed pages video first, and then we will do a um, end of the year. Yes, an end of the year video. And um. I'm going to be doing the tag video that Sassy Colors created a couple years ago. Um, I kind of tweaked it a little bit, but I will be giving her credit because it is her original tag. Um, and I will be tagging some of you, so hopefully you guys will play along. Um, I'm excited to do that. It's going to take me a minute to get it all ready and filmed and edited for you. But hopefully that will come up tomorrow, if not Tuesday. Um, yeah, so my schedule is a little off. I will be getting back to Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Um, not this coming week, but the next week I will get back to my regular schedule. Um, probably unless I can get it done, I probably won't for this week. We'll have a video Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday instead. But anyway, yeah, I hope that's okay. So I have some books here set aside. And I'm going to start with my 10 books to complete eventually. So first one I have for you is my portraits book. I am so close to being done. Now, normally I pick a page out of here for my ABC color um, challenge. There is not one in here. So um, I don't have very many left. I have Fear and Miko. I have Sven. Um, I forget this guy's name. I know you guys keep telling me. Let me know again in the comments below. I don't know why. I cannot. I don't know his name. Um, Berlioz. He needs to have some um, erasing done on him. Some of this pink has gone on him. I have Bagheera and Maximus. Edna. Oops, you got a sneak peek. And then I know I have um, Snow White. And there's another princess. And I, I figured out her name. I can find her. This one, she is um, Elena from Avalar. Avalor? Avalar. Oh, yeah. It's a Disney Channel um, thing. I think that's it. I don't think I'm missing any others. So I'm getting very close. Very, very close to completing this book. And I am very excited. So I didn't pick out any specific pages in there. And then we have Ivy and the Inky Butterfly, which has been on my list because it originally was just Amanda and I, but um, I'm not going to show you this. So this is January's. I'm excited. Yikes. I also didn't pull out my Disney's ABC book because I just showed that in a video. Um, 50 Farmer's Miniatures by Camellia Angel Kova. As you know, I'm completing this, and so is Erica from Elm Colors. We have been helping each other out. Um, like I said, I'm not doing a buddy color, so um, I don't know for sure um, if she wants to, if she's okay with skipping January or, but I wanted to do this book belongs to page because I haven't done that one yet. And then I want to do this one. Um, I'm gonna make these poinsettias. I know I said that for Christmas, I didn't get it done. So I picked two pages in here because I didn't get to color. I did color in this book, but I wanted to get an extra one done. Uh, Gnome Sweet Gnome, I picked two in this one. Um, I picked this one because it looked cozy and very winter-like. 
They are roasting marshmallows on the fire and they're having hot cocoa. Uh, looks like fun. I think they're, yeah. And then I also picked this one here, even though this one's more fall because you got the sunflowers, the leaves and the mushrooms, but it's still, he's drinking hot cocoa and cozy in his chair. He's got his slippers on or no socks. Here's his slippers. Look, he was doing a crossword puzzle book. That's funny. Anyway, it looked cozy and wintry to me. I picked two in there also because I didn't get to it this month. Country chibis, I also didn't get to. Um, I want to. I keep wanting to color this one, and I keep putting it off. Um, I have that one I picked, and I thought campfires and camping is kind of. I don't know why I associate it with winter time. I don't. I don't know why. Benny Blue. I had this one to color for this month. I did not get to it, and I probably won't. Um, and then this guy here, I thought because we've got Super Bowl coming, I thought that one would be perfect. I am not a sports fan, so if I am wrong, if Super Bowl is in February, I'm so sorry, but I thought it was the end of January. Anyway, that's why I picked that guy. That book's almost done too. Now, um, um, I have any romantic country book, any eerie book. I think I'm going to change that. Um, I'm going to pick a specific eerie book and uh, go through that one. But this one is our full book color along for the channel. Um, I am going to, I know I say this every month, but I really am this time going to do two. Uh, color alongs I picked out two separate pages I'm going to do this one so you will get to see how I color skin and people and yeah trees and things and then I also want to do this one it's very uh, wintry with uh, frosty here um, I thought it would be fun you can see how I color snow even though I've, I've done a video already but yeah, so that is Romantic Country, the first tale. Now the next few books I have um, are books that I need to touch or the first, let me get the first two out. First two are just because um, I want to, to color. I haven't colored a Kirby Roseanne's page and I couldn't tell you how long it's been. Oh, uh, months. It's been months. So I want to color the red panda page. Um, I might color both, we shall see, because it's very wintry. Um, I don't know what this one is, I forget. He's a leopard, um, what is he? He is a leopard. And eh, eh, this one right here, critically endangered, this guy. So I'm going to do at least I'm for sure I'm doing the red panda. I'm not sure about that one, but that's Fragile World by Kirby Roseanne's. And then I um, picked a few out in here, very wintry. I have other winter books. I didn't pull them out, though. This one only has, wow, it says more than one. It has two pages colored in it. Um, I love this one with giraffe. I picked out that one. Oh, my pages are falling out. Um, the panda bears with the snow. I loved this. Isn't that so sweet? I liked this one, of course, you know, with the books. This is probably the one I'll, I'll actually do. And then the narwhal page is so cute. Yes, not sure. But that is Mythographic Wild Winter. Okay, now is my 10 books to complete. I mean, 10 books that I have never touched. So I actually have 12 here. Um, I couldn't pick. I was going through and I have so many untouched books. So I'm going to try to color a page in each of these books. 
This is Spirit Animals by Hannah Carlson. Solid color washi means that I have not colored in it. And there is a page in here that I have wanted to color for so long. I'm going to find it for you. I have it marked. Maybe. Um, I like to call this the Harry Potter page. I would like to, um, yeah. I kind of want to... I've never done red hair, like Ginny Weasley, because she's got the freckles. Um, yeah, but I don't know. I'm going to do Hufflepuff, though, because I'm a Hufflepuff. But yes, this has been in one of my wanting to color forever. And that's kind of what I'm going to try to use do this month. Um, this one is... Nice Little Town Christmas 3. I didn't hardly color any Christmas books. And there is a ton of pages in here that are just so cute. Um, like, I love this one. This one could be totally wintry. I mean, it, this one really has nothing to do with Christmas. But my favorite one... I'm getting to... Maybe this one. I love this one. Just watching it snow outside. A little ladybug friend. So cute. And then, of course, the cover page is fun. I know they're kind of Christmassy, but I'm still doing how many candy canes. Uh, I picked Mini Mania. I thought we'd start with the first one. I did not pick a specific page. Um, I just think these books are absolutely adorable. So I'm going to have fun with this one. I might color more than one. We shall see. Um, yes. Love, love, love this, these books. So there's Mini Mania. Um, Serendipity by RJ Hampson. I thought I would do one in here. I really like the, let me see if I can find it. I opened right to it last time. I really want to do the Alice in Wonderland page. This one. I think this one would be fun. With the Mad Hatter and the Rabbit and it's got Dinah and the Drink Me. And it's got a crown or a queen. I don't know. I thought it would be fun. So that's Serendipity by R.J. Hampson. Um, I have most of this collection. I don't have them all. I'm, I'm missing a few. This one is the Snow White one. So I was thinking winter and snow for Snow White. There are so many cute pages in this book. Yeah. I'm kind of not sure I want to do a double page spread. And most of these are a double page spread. But we shall see. Like that one would be fun. Except for her hair is already colored. I don't like that. Here, this one. Like, I love this. I do. I think that is so cute. So if I'm brave enough, maybe I will do that one. But yeah, there are just so many. They're almost all double page spreads. So we shall see. So that is Snow White by Fabiana Atanasio. I want to color something in here, probably an Olaf or an Anna and Elsa page. Um, I'm going to scan it in though, and I'm going to make a copy of it because I want this coloring book to last forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. <laughs> so look at him. Oh, I could do him. I could do Kristoff. That is just so cute. Oh my gosh. We've got, yeah, I don't even think Olaf is in here. Max! I'm sorry, but this is just the cutest coloring book that I own. Oh. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, I didn't see an Olaf page. We got Brave Merida. Uh oh, the evil 
Oh, look. Elsa and Anna. That is too cute. I don't think this one would scan very well. But maybe. So, yeah. This is my first Ultimate Coloring Book um, by Disney. Does it tell you who the illustrator is? No, but it's Scholastic Australia. Yes, it is. Um, this is the brand new Eerie book, and I'm guessing you can all guess which one I want to color because it's winter, um, even though we don't have snow here. But I so want to do Lion, the Witch, in the Wardrobe with Mr. Tumnus and Lucy um, in the snow with the lamppost. I'm very excited to color in this one. Um, the Matchstick Mouse, a winter coloring book. This one actually goes with my 10 books to complete eventually. Um, I thought I'd colored in this book, but I guess I didn't. Maybe I'm supposed to color it with somebody. Ow. Maybe this is one of the buddy colors I was supposed to do. But um, some page in here. Or two, or three, or four. Matchstick Mouse, a winter coloring book. I have um, Winter Mandalas by Alexandra Franzis. Um, most of these, like the snowman one would be fun, are pretty Christmassy, but uh, are here. Oh, there, that one, right there, look. Winter gnomes and trees. Or you could do hats and scarves. Um, I thought that one would be fun. Pulled out a Camellia Dierco <clears throat> uh, pop manga dragons and other mythical creatures. I have not touched this book, and there are some really cute pages in here. So um, I love this right here. I don't know why, but I love that one. So cute. I didn't pick any specific page out of here. But I thought it would be fun. These are cute. I love this one. It's so cute. But yeah, anyway, I like this one too. Or here we can just continue our Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe and do Mr. Tumnus here in the rain. That's more like my winter is, is rain. So cute. Anyway, there's that one. Um, I am going to be trying to put in a coloring hidden book in every month. Um, I now have over 20 books and most of them are untouched. Um, this is a Chris Ortega one called Fantasy Kingdom Special. Um, I don't know which one I'm going to do, but this one will be good practice. Ooh, I, I really like that one for hair and skin. So, yeah, I really like, I don't know if it's a him or a her illustrations. I really, really do. And then last but not least is uh, Mariola Budek. I have her, uh, let's see if we can get to it. Here, I have her snowmen ones. So I have her snowmen, the first one and the second one. So any of these snowmen would be so, so fun to do for January. I might do more than one. Um, Maybe I can do, let me know in the comments below, would you like to do just one big group buddy color? Or we can do one of these. Cause I can do that, that's only one. So, I do they're just so cute. Look at that one. So, I don't know. These are the gnomes. Now we're to gnomes. So yeah, one of the snowmen would be a lot of fun to do. And let me know what you guys, if you guys, what you guys think. So yeah, 
So that's my plans. That is what my plans are for January. Uh, again, I am so sorry to all my buddies. If I didn't finish my December buddy colors, they will get done. Hopefully by the end of this week, um, which is uh, Friday the 5th. Yes. So you should all have them by the 5th. Um, hope you guys understand. Um, I don't like to disappoint and I usually always finish what I agree upon. I'm one of those, if I commit, um, I don't back out. Um, but anyway, so yeah. Um, let me know um, if you guys have any of these coloring books and um, I would love to know some of the books you're planning to color in for January. So put that in the comments below what coloring books you're going to color in. Um, and maybe I'll get some ideas. And yeah. Thank you for watching this video. If you're new and you made it all the way through, thank you so much. Um, if I would love to have you join us. So please subscribe and hit the bell button so you're notified when I post new videos. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And again, comment below what coloring books you're going to be coloring in in January. And I so love making these videos and I look forward to talking to you all real soon.